Ecrisat's global headquarters are here in Hyderabad, India, but across Asia, Ecrisat works in a number of countries. Some examples of our work in these countries include, in China, we work for crop and livestock productivity improvement and contribute to resilience and livelihoods enhancement. We work for the improvement of uh, chickpea, groundnut, sorghum, millet and watershed management. In Vietnam, Ecrisat works for the improvement of sweet sorghum and groundnut. In partnership, we also encourage farmer participatory research and extension activities. In Myanmar, our focus is on improvement of grain legumes and natural resource management. We particularly focus on enhancement of chickpea, pigeon pea and groundnut, which together account to 40% of legume area in the country. Ecrisat's research work also contributes to agriculture development in Thailand, Laos, Nepal, Pakistan, Bangladesh and Sri Lanka. Here in India, where one in three of the world's poorest people live, Ecrisat's work is particularly important. Many of these people live in semi-arid tropics which are prone to drought and water shortage and where 60% of its agriculture is rain-fed. Ecrisat's work across the value chains from soil water management, improving new varieties, crop management and building agribusiness. High-end research and field testing are conducted here on the main campus spread across 3,500 acres of land. The research here at ICRISAT headquarters include crop improvement programs which together with national partners contributed to release of 887 crop varieties in 19 countries of Asia and 35 countries of Africa. Center of Excellence in Genomics enables predicting plant phenotypes based on genotype. Phenotyping facilities for pest, disease and drought enables development of resistant varieties. Our gene bank has 120,000 accessions from 144 different countries. Agribusiness Incubator facilitates entrepreneurship and promotes technology commercialization to support farmers and crop production. Buchetna work aims to enhance crop production and sustainability through soil, water and nutrient management practices. One example of impact of ICRISAT's work in my own field of research is we have developed high oli groundnut varieties for the first time in Asia. High oli groundnut varieties have health benefits to consumers and benefits to the industry through enhanced shelf life. 